For years now, the students at Troy Athens High School spend one week doing something amazing. It's called Charity Week, and just wait until you hear how much money these students raise. Priya Man live tonight with the big reveal. Hi, Priya. Hey, you know, this has been a tradition here since the mid 80s and it's completely run by the students. They pick the charity. They pick which fundraising events are going to hold and boy, did it pay off. To be able to raise as much money and do it with our school, our community, it's it's like we're all like a big family. And with that, Troy Athens seniors flooded the basketball court. Less, like, to there's no words. Yeah. <laughs> crying. Yeah. <laughs> a lot. <laughs> a lot of hard work. And I'm so happy it's going to a good foundation. Students raise more than $117,000 for Alex's Saints Foundation. Super emotional. Um, this is really personal. Alex was my former student and he's also my neighbor. A decade ago, Alex St. Pierre took part in Charity Week when he was a student here. Just one day before his 25th birthday, he died from a drug overdose. He was everything. You know, I spent every, all my time with him. Uh, we, you know, it's the saying, your brother from another mother, that was him. After last year's Charity Week was canceled due to COVID, this year, students made up for it. There were concerts. We all are going to say abracadabra. Magic shows, the chance to smush a custard pie into a teacher's face, and even a belly flop competition. All of this raising money to prevent another young person from dying of a drug overdose. We're going to save lives. With this money, there will be lives saved, without a doubt in my mind. And for these kids to be a part of that, I think it's incredible to know, for them to know that they're saving lives. Yeah, just absolutely incredible work. You know, there have been so many challenges during the pandemic. The event was canceled last year, and this year organizers decided to just have seniors inside the gym. So students watched a live stream in their classrooms, and it had different camera angles and hosts. And they said after all of this hard work, they were just glad they could celebrate together in school. And from everyone at Local 4, Way to go, guys. Right? Reporting live in Troy. I'm Priya Man, Local 4. Just fantastic Oh, work. what a great story, number one. And just a great cause, number two. And just a wonderful experience for these kids to even uh, have themselves in high school. Thanks, yeah. Priya.